show you how to play two songs at the same time. If you are a fingerstyle guitar player and you've got your fingers together pretty good, I'm going to show you how to play Yankee Doodle Dixie that Chet Atkins did so many years ago, two tunes at once. And once I show you how to do it, you'll be amazed. I'm going to go through it step by step and uh, it's not as difficult as you think. So without further ado, let's get right at it. Yankee Doodle second and the third string and the first string is open just like an A major right well we're not going to worry about this guy we're not going to play that on the fourth string because we're not going to be using it so what we're going to do with the fingers you're going to play this right and as you hit those three notes on the third string on the second fret thumb, you're going to play the open fifth string twice, right with them. Like that. For the third note, this finger's got to come down and play a B note. There. This is the first part. Just like that. Very simple when you think about it. Just don't think about playing two songs at once and just pretend you're playing a lick. It really works that way. Okay, that's the first part. Next step. You're going to play an open B string. You're going to move off of there. You play an open B. And as you do that, your ring finger is going to go on the 5th string on the 4th fret. Your 1st finger is going to go on the 2nd string on the 2nd fret. You pick them together. Do a hammer to the 3rd fret on the 2nd string. Like that. So we've got open 2nd. Hammer. Like that. So we have so far. Second, make those two little moves there with these two fingers. Hammer. Now, this is easy here as well. Fifth string, pick together. First is open again. Ring finger on the uh, fourth fret, fifth string. To the second fret. This finger comes up, plays the second string on the second fret, and open six. All at the same time. Like that. Right from the top. Here we go. Okay. 
Then we got this. First finger, second fret, first string with the open fifth. Two notes together. The third note, I'm bringing my thumb up to play the fifth string on the second fret. On the third note, all together. Like that. And then I've got my ring finger coming down to play the fifth string. On the fourth fret, like that, all by itself, and then I'm going to do an open first with an open fifth, like that. So we've got so far. second string on the seventh fret and when I pick that I'm gonna pick an open six. This is a really easy part. Once you do that, pick them together. You're gonna to do this ninth fret, slide to the tenth, first string, seventh fret, to the ninth. And then when you hit the ninth, you're gonna pick your open fifth with it. Okay, so from there again, we're going to do two notes, first two together, first and fifth together, second one by itself. two fingers on the first and the second on the fifth fret. Like that. My thumb comes up to the fifth string on the fourth fret. You can use your first finger and play that if you like. It's a lot easier for a lot of guys. And then once you get that position, this is what you do. So first and five together. Second by itself, first and four together, and that four is open, right? That's all it is. It's pretty cool. So again, from this little walk up. second fret. Again, just the two notes. And then we're going to do first string to the second string on the second fret. And then ring finger, sixth string, fourth fret. Back to the first, together. Then open six to the second fret to the fourth fret with the ring finger on the sixth string. Baby finger comes down to the fourth fret on the third string, right behind it, right there. And you put your index finger now back on the second fret on the second string. And this is what you're going to have. You're going to pick the third and the sixth together, then the second. 
all by itself. And they're going to finish on the A note, open fifth, and the A note, third string, second fret. Like that. So from this walk up here again. separately one note by itself you know uh, so just work your way through it uh, do it step by step and uh, I'm sure you'll you'll get it it's a, it's a neat thing to play it's a neat trick to, to show to people and it usually blows everybody away that's for sure when you do it so be sure to subscribe to my channel check me out on my author page jwcollinsauthor.com I am a uh, uh, published author of historical fiction, period westerns, and be sure to check me out on Facebook and Twitter. Uh, you can find my books on Amazon from my website, or you can just punch up uh, any Amazon site, .ca, .com, .uk, whatever, and you'll, uh, you'll find me, J.W. Collins, author. Be sure to also uh, subscribe to my email list so you can get a lot of notifications and free stuff. I've written a couple of uh, short stories as well. They're free that you can download. And uh, make sure also that you hit that uh, bell for notification of new videos. Apparently that is really important, apparently, to be notified of new videos when you hit that bell. It really helps. So until next time, have the best day you can. See you then.